Hello there and welcome to my channel. In today's tutorial, I will talk about how to extract the BizShare information or data in ETABS software. Okay, this lecture will help for those uh, for those people who are concerned about how to quickly get a data of a result of a structure to quickly get its result. So I decided to make some tutorials about short videos because in previous time I were widely explained all the details about it is designing analyzation and other steps okay but currently I will do very short videos about the results of the structure so let us start I will come here to the display afterward coming to show tables then I'm coming here to anal analysis result. Afterward, I'm coming to the base reactions and I will select base reaction table here. You can choose the load patterns. It is up to you how many load patterns you want to choose. I will select all. Okay. And you can just select some load cases. You can choose for earthquake x axis, y axis, or wind load, and others. I will select all the load cases at the moment. I will select OK and press. Afterward, I will say it is result. Look here, output models. I will choose here and filter about earthquake x axis y-axis and I will apply a multiple item filter look here this is the base uh, base base share about x-axis I will just copy it and paste in word file or excel sheet in whatever you want or you can just simply come to the file and export current table to the excel sheet it will export and transfer to the excel sheet automatically so look here it has been exported here to the Excel sheet you can use for for the future purpose of collecting your data so this is about shear base shear x-axis and this is about base shear of y-axis it is approximately near in the same so this was the base shear of a this structure which is third story building I hope this lecture will help you and do not forget to subscribe this channel and press the bell icon for getting a very quick notification while I'm uploading the new tutorial. Have a wonderful time. Bye bye.